Vous voyez, une grande audience. Il y a bien la surface. Il y a droit de vote. Il y a un Il y a Although the economic outlook remains deeply worrisome, there is a way out. Now, the world must find the political will, the collective will, to do what it knows has to be done. So let me, having acknowledged what has been done, let me just offer my perspective on what remains to be done. And in my view, there are three imperatives. One is stronger growth. Two is larger firewalls. Three, deeper integration. It's not something that the euro area partners can resolve exclusively on their own. The rest of the world matters in many ways. We must step up the fund's lending capacity. The goal here is not to substitute, but to supplement resources that Europe will be putting on the table, but also because we're not just working for the Eurozone, even though it is the epicenter of the crisis, but also, and very importantly so, to meet the needs of what I call the innocent bystanders. The IMF would aim to raise up to 500 billions of additional lending capacity. This is a defining moment. It's not about saving any one country or any one region. It's about saving the world from this downward economic spiral that I mentioned at the beginning. It is about avoiding a 1930s moment. The longer we wait, the worse it will get. The only solution is to move forward together, because our collective economic future depends on that. Just observe that with the euro area economy slowing down, 